Today's video is brought to you by URCD Keys, the best source for Windows 10 and Office Professional product keys at deeply discounted prices. More details at the end of the video. Many times on this channel, we've discussed why 32 gigabytes of RAM and eight cores is the beast. Well, we got a comment here from Jacob's Tech Zone who actually affirmed this and talked about it, but I want to offer a counter thought and opinion. You don't actually need 32 gigs of RAM and you don't actually need eight cores. I know, strange for me to say this. Give me a chance to explain. The word need implies that you can't do something or you will suffer tremendously if you go without. You need food. If you don't eat food, you will die. So you absolutely have to have food or the rest of life doesn't really make any difference. You need water. You need shelter. Yes, Tim Tams, absolutely. You don't need a gaming computer. However, putting that issue aside, since you're here, we're going to assume that you want to play games. We're talking about gaming here. Obviously, content creation, other things are different. If you want to play most PC games, you could actually do that, hold on, on four cores. Would you believe me if I said that you can play like 98% of all the PC games released in the past 10 years on a four core processor? In the last 10 years. That's the, there you got the key point right there. Four cores and especially eight threads makes a big difference. Four cores and eight threads will let you play the majority of games. Certainly the past two years that stopped being the case. Well, that's the 2%. The AAA games. Well, not even all games in the past two years. There's games in the past two years that'll play fine on a four-core chip. True. But not the big budget AAA games. Try playing Cyberpunk 2077 on a four-core eight-thread chip and... Well, okay. Here's the thing. You don't need more than a four-core eight-thread chip to play Cyberpunk. What, on low detail? At 720p? No, it'll, it'll run at 1080p high detail. It'll run like crap, but it will run. <laughs> you could get used to it. We are actually going to do a video series. Uh, most of you know, or at least some of you know, who are a uh, new member of the Deal Nation family is Muse. Now, she has two computers. She has a desktop gaming computer and she has a MSI gaming laptop. And she games on these and she plays, what's that new one called, Valorant? Valheim. Valheim. She plays Valheim on it and she plays a few other things on it. But let's just say that both machines are not state of the art. We are totally going to do a video showing the difference of upgrading from those machines to newer machines. Her MSI gaming laptop is an i7. It's an H chip. It's a big one. It's got a nice big 17 inch screen. It has a dedicated NVIDIA graphics card. It's got 12 gigs of RAM. It's halfway between eight and 16. It works, but I'll give you a hint. It has Windows 7 installed on it. Yeah. So we are going to do a video showing the difference because here's the funny thing. You can absolutely play most games on a machine like that, but it's not a great experience. It's when we say eight cores and 32 gigs is the future and it's what you should go to when you're, when you're buying now, it's not that you cannot buy a six core chip. It's not that you cannot go with 16 gigs of RAM. You obviously can. You obviously can play games on those, but it's an inferior experience. What we're really saying is if you cannot all afford it, it is worth going to eight cores and it is worth going to 32 gigs because it is a better experience. It's not about average frame rates. It's not about whether the game will run. It's about smoother frame rates. It's about smoother multitasking or fewer hitches because anything running in the background, be it music, be it Discord, be it a web browser, be it a video on a second screen, be it just Windows checking for updates or antivirus running in the background. I mean, these things, and unless you like strip your machine bare, you know, most people probably have 10 things in their test tray, right? And the 32 gigs of RAM reduces wear and tear on your SSD because it reduces swap and it gives Windows more RAM to use as a disk cache. 
and it makes loading a little bit quicker, and it reduces swap file use. It does. So how many videos have we made or talked about, you need 32 gigs of RAM, you're crazy if you don't upgrade, and eight cores is the future, and the future is today. How many of those have we done? A lot. Okay. If you're watching us and you have a Ryzen 5 2600, and you have 16 gigs of RAM and an RX 580, and you have one monitor and you play at 1080p, most games probably run fine. They would run better on newer hardware, but you are not incapable of playing current games. You could, can't believe I'm even saying this, you could play Cyberpunk 2077 on that machine. It would have to be 1080p medium detail. It would not be 60 frames per second smooth. It would stutter a bit. You certainly would have to close everything else running. You know what? You could. You could get used to it. You could run it. But if somebody who has a Ryzen 5 2600 and an RX 580 and 16 gigs of RAM upgrades to a Ryzen 7 3700X, 32 gigs of RAM, and even a 2070 Super, for example, you know what would happen to their brain? You would be saying what Jacob's Tech Zone said, which is, that was so worth it. Assuming you can afford it and, you know, that's obviously the other issue. URCDKeys is the best source for genuine Windows 10 and Office Professional product keys that work the first time, every time. Get 20% off normal prices using our discount code BST for Bite Size Tech and the link in the video description below. $15 gets you a Windows 10 Professional OEM key that is a real product key, activates directly with Microsoft, use it forever as it links to your Microsoft account and it works through reinstalls. Get a full copy of Office 2019 Professional Plus for about $50 that redeems at setup.office.com using your Microsoft account. It also works forever through reinstalls. We have been using URCD keys for almost three years now and recommend you do so as well.